Just a minute, one minute to wager now on the fifth race. That should be a good one. Three fillies come into this race off of wins. They're moving in behind the gate. Last call to place your wagers. Gates on the move for race five. Heather Jean Ann, Rick Prather, Torpedo Wave, Alan Bowen, Aries Conquest, Irv Miller. What's my name again? Mike Brink and Fox Valley Catch Me, Danny Moore. They're at the head of the stretch. Race five. Here they come. And they're off and pacing. Torpedo Wave on the inside. She goes right out with the undefeated Aries Conquest as they race into the first turn. And Alan's going to keep the front now. Torpedo Wave by about three parts of a length. Aries Conquest looking for the pocket second. Hasn't got it yet. Heather Jean Ann might try to keep her out there. And it gets a little tight here. We swing around the first turn. Up front, though, the leader by a length. Torpedo Wave. Irv works his way into the pocket second. Right there, third is Heather Jean Ann. Racing fourth, what's my name again? And at the back, it's Fox Valley. Catch me. The first quarter was in 30 and two-fifths of a second. Off a quarter and 30 and two fifths, we race around the Emperor, turn over to the three eights. Torpedo Wave, fresh off an impressive victory at Lewiston. Leads by a length and a quarter for Alan Bowen. The undefeated Aries Conquest is right there, second for Irv Miller. Heather, Jean Ann, and Rick Prather racing a third as we race towards a half mile marker. What's my name again? Is back there, fourth and Fox Valley catch me as the trailer. Past the half, we race into the lower turn. Torpedo wave by a length and a quarter. The half in 101 and three fifths of a second. Off the half in 101 and three. It's still torpedo wave on our hometown track here. Leading by a length and a half. Aries Conquest is right there, second. Racing third. Heather Jean Ann, fourth on the inside. What's my name again? Followed by Fox Valley Catch Me, single file. We race towards a three quarter mile marker. It's still Torpedo Wave by a length and a quarter. Aries Conquest has got the garden trip. She's right there, second. Heather Jean Ann is back there, third. Three quarters and 132 and four. What's my name again? It's out and driving. And here comes Aries Conquest. It's Torpedo Wave on the inside. Aries Conquest on the outside. An eighth of a mile to go. It's still Torpedo Wave by a neck. They turn for home. Aries Conquest coming on now for Irv Miller. Aries Conquest to the outside. Torpedo Wave on the inside. Aries Conquest is going right on by. It's all Aries Conquest by three at the wire. Torpedo Wave will be second tight for third. Look like what's my name again. And folks, this is a new track record here at the Brown County Fair for two-year-old pacing fillies. We've had a lot of fast uh, miles here over the years, but this is a new track record for a two-year-old pacing filly. Formerly, it had been uh, held by I Caught You Looking and Tom Walker in 19... And let's get a quick word with Irvin Miller. Irv, looked like it got a little tight there coming off the first turn, going the first quarter mile. Were you concerned at all? Yeah, it was a little close, but the hole was opened up, so it was all right. You won the State Fair two-year-old filly pace. You won it last year with loyal opposition. You won it a couple of years before that with incredible Tilly. Point being, you've had some really nice two-year-old fillies. How does this filly rank with some of your past filly stars? Uh, she's really coming around. Andy's got one that, we're, or I got one that we're racing in Chicago. Andy's been driving. He drove this one the other day and thought she might be a little better. And the other one's winning 56 up there, so. So this one may have a decent shot. Irv, we, it always makes us proud when these fillies go on from the fair circuit to win Springfield, so good luck in a few days. Thank you. Another hand for Irv Miller, folks. And uh, you heard Irv talk about Andy. For those of you who do not follow harness racing, the Andy that he mentioned is his brother, Andy Miller, who's one of the most successful harness drivers in Chicago. One more question, especially for you folks from here in Brown County. We were talking about Alan Bowen. Alan had a tough assignment going up against an unbeaten filly. Were you proud of the job Alan did in that race, folks? Yeah, his filly raced real nice. Ed, back to you. 
Thank you, Kurt.